我去過好多唔同國家嘅酒窖咯，但係咧都好少見到一個咁長啦、咁巨型、咁震撼嘅一個地下酒窖嘅。咁好似誒依一個啦，咁佢哋咧就二零零零年咧就叫咗一位畫家啦，去為佢哋特登咧去雕刻嘅。咁就是因為想慶祝咧零零年嘅時候咧，佢哋嘅醫院咧就係修復完成啊。咁大家可以見到依一度咧，就係代表咧幾位老人家啦，又即係誒有坐喺輪椅度啦，唔開心啦，因為。晚晚都好似咧，黑暗嘅。咁但係當咧佢哋住咗依一間嘅醫院之後咧，哇！咩都唔同咗啦，又有酒飲啦，又有嘢食啦，每日咧陽光普照啦，而且咧日日啦都可以喺度跳舞啊！連一個個嘅惡鬼啊，佢都希望咧拎住個酒杯，希望飲到啲酒嘅。經過啦，我哋都見到有一啲好古舊嘅木桶嘅，就好似依個咁樣啦，係一八九零年代咧就去興建嘅。咁大家可以見到而家依一啲嘅木啦，係真係非常之古舊啊。不過佢哋依然係用緊依一個嘅木桶嘅喎。不過咧，依度有個小問題要考下觀眾啦，究竟依個係咩動物呢？開估啦！依、这、一個咧唔係綿羊仔啊，居然係獅子啊！因為當時咧啲畫家咧係未見過獅子㗎，咁佢哋咧就憑藉住咧當時期咧啲人咧嘅書咧去想像獅子係咩樣，於是咧就雕刻咗依個披住羊皮嘅獅子啦。大家都知道啦，德國啦係雷斯令嘅故鄉啦。咁喺依幾集咧，亦都介紹咗好多德國嘅白葡萄酒俾大家。我相信大家都覺得嗯好正啦。咁但係我居然咧今日就識咗一位嘅釀酒師啊，佢就話俾我聽，佢要將佢所有嘅田地全部都淨係釀做 Pinot Noir 一種嘅誒、呃、紅提子嘅啫。究竟依位奇人係咩人嚟嘅咧？介紹俾大家認識，依一位就係釀酒師 Benedict。Benedict hello。Hello. Actually, I know that you uh, have so many passion in uh, Pinot Noir, and you want to turn your land all into Pinot Noir. Why is yeah. this so? We are in Germany. I think that is a, that is a thing uh, when you grown up uh, somewhere, yeah. uh, where you where you have sat around like like me. Mm -hmm. I have uh, where I grown up all with Pinot, or my parents only grow Pinot. For me, it's a it's a passion. It's a fascinating uh, wine because it's a red wine, of course, mm -hmm. but it's it's. Um, not so strong, not so, not so bright. Mm. It's more fine, elegant. You're always searching for some complex things, some fine things. It's a, it's a challenge to make it better and better. Mm. And um, yeah, in the last years, especially in Germany, uh, when, the, when it became warmer and warmer, yeah. we have the, the power to do it. Yeah. And uh, yeah, the, the results international show uh, how great the, the, the sort uh, ripes here. And for me, it's the, the only grape dry where I can 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 give so much passion to and, and work with because it's a, it, it's a great fascination the complexity the, the fruit uh, the fineness in the red wine mostly you know it only from the white yeah uh, but that in the white red wine is the fascinating part for me okay and i've uh, realized your vineyard uh, just behind next yeah. by us yeah. very <laughs> stiff and um is the southwest facing yeah. slope yeah. and when we just arrived there is the sunlight shine directly yeah. on yeah. it. So yeah. so can you explain a bit your terroir of yeah. Um, yeah. of um, and the slope and yeah, of course. Um, uh, where we uh, grow our corn mm. the best wines is the Schlossberg. Mm -hmm. And Schlossberg is famous because it's uh, it's faced you you say it in the southwest mm. in the best parts of south southwest. Um, but that's not the only part. Um, you have this, uh, this, this, the lot of walls. Mm. Sometimes it's three kilometers walls uh, a, a hectare, uh, and above there is the Spessart. This is mm. one of the, um, the, the um, hills, mountain parts here in Germany, one of the highest. And it's a few uh, kilometers by air to the second highest point. So we have. Uh, over the day, the hottest part, mm. and overnight, the cooler part. Mm. So there are not only wines who is, who is hot and have color and have intensity. Mm. Um, it is also 
the coolness that comes in, we give an acidity, the lightness. So a very intense wine, uh, but also even uh, also with the lightness, will makes a good Pinot Noir. It doesn't matter if it's from French, from California, from New Zealand, from Germany, from here. It doesn't matter. A good Pinot Noir has always the elegance, mm. and to become that, it's very um, you need this this uh, difference between night and air to get acid to have to be balanced. So and this is what we have perfectly perfectly here at the Schlossberg. And so this is the reason because it's a great vineyard site. Pinot是一种葡萄的重口味,其实是很难种的葡萄,也不是很容易种的。Pinot是一种葡萄的重口味,是比较细粒,而且它的皮也比较薄,所以出到来的时候,那个口感通常是会比较优雅。通常我们在
係唔會有太大嘅分別嘅。咁但係如果觀眾朋友想買一啲舊酒嘅時候咧，就要注意啦喎。咁大家咧就可以揀選呢啲比較係相對嚟講大支裝少少嘅。咁因為咧酒喺大支裝嘅入面咧，就會基本上同空氣接觸嘅面積咧會細啲，亦都會減慢佢嘅。啊、我哋叫 o x i d i z e 嘅一個速度，即係氧化嘅速度，咁所以咧個酒質咧就會顯得年輕少少啦。好、oh, 啊，等個船，等個船。其實咧，好多人都覺得德國人係好嚴謹啦，又唔笑，好酷咁。其實佢哋係好有禮貌，而且咧非常之樂於助人噶。咁如果佢幫咗你，你應該點講咧？咁喺德文嚟講啦，你就可以話 Danke schön，Danke schön。Schön 係非常好咁解 ，Danke 係多謝咁解，即係非常之多謝啦。Danke schön。其實除咗美酒美食之外咧，德國都係一個非常之適合旅遊嘅好地方嚟嘅，就好似依一啲咧充滿住小鎮風情嘅小街啦，到處都係噶。而家咧就已經係八點半噶啦，但你睇下咧天係依然係咁光咯，咁所以我做咗成日嘢，一啲都唔覺得攰啊！我而家都要揾下啲德國朋友玩下先。集嘅德国葡萄酒之旅，我希望咧观众朋友可以喺呢个节目度学习咗一啲葡萄酒嘅知识，同时咧同我一样可以感受到咧德国葡萄酒嘅美妙之处。Cheers。